glamour. Let's talk glitz. Let's talk attraction. But that's enough about me. Let's welcome to the studio Dion Robertson. I'm joking, of course. Miss Great Britain. Miss Universe Great Britain 2015, 2016. Well done, Dion. Thank you very much for coming in. Thank you very much for having me. And you can see this on Facebook and on Twitter because Dion is wearing the sash. Is it contractual? You can never take that off. Basically, yes. <laughs> <laughs> now, there has been a bit of controversy. I'll cut straight to the chase on this one about your appointment as uh, Miss Universe Great Britain. Because Just Miss Great Britain. I do apologise, um, <laughs> because it was the previous incumbent, Zara Holland, whom we've spoken, lost her title after some shenanigans on a TV show, and you two met up together yesterday, did you we not, on did, Loose Women? Yes, yes. What happened? Because there have been newspaper reports which might be a bit over the top. Yes, um, obviously it wasn't nice to come together for the first time after it's all happened, but so it's a little bit more fiery than maybe we had anticipated, but she got her points across, I think I got my points across, and that was the kind of whole idea of it. Just the two of us together, then no one can kind of be in between. Just the two of us, two of you and me and the hot girls. <laughs> Trying to forget what about was that. was it like in the green room before? Did you did she start the argy-bargy early? No, um, before in the green room we weren't actually together. She was in one place and we were in the other place. So it was the first time we actually seen each other was on air live on the show. And how how long have you been involved in beauty contests? Or was this your first one? No, this wasn't my first one. I'm getting a bit old now, so I've been involved. Well, let, me, let me have a guess, 45, 50? <laughs> yes. I'm joking, of course. <laughs> um, no, so I've been involved in pageants for about six years now. Okay. And they're a huge, huge part of my life. Absolutely love them. So this is like a dream come true to kind of finish on a high. Even if it is only for a short period of time, it's still like an amazing accomplishment. And how do you feel about the point that Zara made, which was on the night, she was chosen as the Winner. Absolutely. But and but so you're but you know She was the right person at the time, she worked hard, so did we all though, and we can't really take that away from each of the contestants, each of the finalists. Um she won on the night, but unfortunately she made the wrong decision and gave that up and And then some and she and the, the, the title was stripped from her. Yep. Do you think they were right to take the title away from her? I think it had to happen. It's happened before in pageants, it'll probably happen again in the sense of first runner up they do step up and into the position. So I've, I've not done anything wrong. I think people maybe think I have. Um, we all know as pageant girls what happens and you're in the, that. And you're the kind of, you're in touch to be the super sub, effectively. <laughs> there we go. Ah. And um, when you, I mean, you come in this morning, you're absolutely fantastic. Very glad. <laughs> oh, thank How you. How long does that take you? Oh, not long. I'm a professional now. 30 minutes, hair, makeup, dress, go. Cool. Get out of town. Really, <laughs> Dion? Yes, I have. 30 minutes? <laughs> the whole lot. You have to yeah, be quick to in this industry. some of my team. <laughs> Start with Alex and Johnny, please. Look at the state of those two. Like a bag of Spanish tie up ugly, the two of them. And what kind of things will you be doing um, during your reign as Miss Yeah, Great I've Britain? got lots of good things planned. I've already been up to a few things. Of course, there is the Miss Great Britain final next month. So that's in September. The tickets are on sale. So you can come along, see what a pageant is actually like. I'll be handing over the title. So it'll be a great event. And I've got... I'm doing a 5K for Cancer Research UK, so that's Good for pretty you. muddy. So I'll get. And can people uh, sponsor you on that? Yes, just absolutely. Giving just giving. Facebook uh huh. Okay. Yep. So lots of exciting things planned. So I can't wait. Now I grew up in the 70s. I know I don't look old enough. And the 80s when they used to televise all these pageants. Yes. And you not only have Miss Great Britain and then Miss Universe or whatever. You, you had them all. You know, yeah. things like Miss TV Times. <laughs> Seriously, there was yeah. a Miss TV Times competition. Um, and then they tended not to do what they did in Miss Congeniality, which was show a mm. talent. What happens? At the, what happened at the Miss Great Britain pageant? Because it wasn't on the telly that I saw. No, that's it. So they're kind of not on the TV as much anymore. You can still get them online, which is great. And especially other countries, like I'll be going off to the international final, so Miss Tourism World, which will be amazing. So they're well, where's begging that big other. Deal? So this is it's, it was Malaysia last year, so it's not confirmed this year, but they're always in these exciting countries. So in other countries, they are as big. Um, so we're trying to build that back up. And Miss Great Britain is one where you can enter the talent range. You can enter Beach Body. What was your you talent? Did you enter talent? I'm a dancer. So <laughs> the star jump action was it? Yeah, of course. Bobby <laughs> and um, when you're when you're asked if you're saying to it about ambitions, yeah. did you say you wanted world peace and then into hunger? Well, who doesn't want world peace? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> um, no, because it, it has changed. It has moved on from there. And I think the little things that you can do in your community, the people closest to you, they're helping anyway. So you don't need to go big and make up these big stories oh world peace and i'll do this and i'll do that but even the little things make big changes so that's kind of my my push on it brilliant stuff great to see you oh, good luck thank with that, you so good much luck for with that big me. run and you want to sponsor D dion go to dion robertson on the just giving page that's miss great britain 2015-16 talking to me paul ross on talk radio there's glamour it's 8 59